Hello, freaks and geeks, and welcome to another episode of Surviving Rimworld. And, well, this episode, we're gonna restart the colony, because, uh, we kind of had a, uh, a very bad, um, a very bad time with uh, Randy Random over here. So, I'm just gonna go with, um, classic, uh, classic Cassandra, or Cassandra classic, oh god, I said her name backwards um i believe this is the new world i made uh yes hold my beer <laughs> yes anyways um i've oh no actually before we get started um there's a, a lot of mods that i've actually uh added in so if you can see uh just pause the video if you want to take a look um all the links to these mods will be down in the description below so uh you know you know, all the links should uh, go to directly to the um, forum, and then you know you can find the download uh, link from there. But yes, the... uh, yeah. Let's just go ahead and go with uh, Cass uh, Cassandra Classic on rough though on a far Tarzan. I don't know, Tari. I I I can't. I don't know how to pronounce that. So I'm just going to ignore that name and uh, find a good place for us to um, settle down. Now, um, I'm... Hold on, let's just do a couple of random sites and see how... It... No. Uh... Tropical Forest. Uh, the 11th of winter through the 1st of winter. Huh. Wait a minute, that's... Oh, yeah, that's a very long... The 6th of spring to the 6th of fall. Where is this exactly? Temperate forest. Lat. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's, uh, go with this one. I shall see. Alright, yeah. I see right not. Um, let's go ahead and go to advance. Make this a tad bitter, bigger. Um... Yeah, let's go to nine, nine thousand. Alright, select site. Now, um, I'm going to uh, take a moment here and figure out, um, figure out who my people were. Actually, uh, let's see, hon. Let's actually take a quick look. You see, in intellectual crafting. Wow. All these people are incapable of intellectual. Oh my goodness, I can't even fucking say that word. They're they can't research. Um, so I am going to. Uh, oh wow, pes. Pe he's a pessimist, ugly. Uh, Mac is Mac. Oh my goodness, I. Uh, uh, But yeah, anyways, I'm just gonna, um, randomize these people, um, and hopefully we'll get, uh, or, what am I saying? <clears throat> but yes, I will take some time and not exactly, you know, min-max these people a lot, uh, you know, a whole lot, but, um, you know, traits like that, with that set, um, I might want to just go ahead and, uh, random randomize, um, a couple of these other people. So I'll be right back. All right, so um, I've done rem randomize the people, and we came up with our three starting colonists. By the way, um, I went ahead and renamed um, the colonists same our starting colonists the same as a uh, as the last time because I felt like uh, you know it. They need a second chance, but in new bodies. <laughs> I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Anyways. <coughs> Excuse me. Ugh. Anyways. Um, anyways, we got Secret here, who was who's 19, um, and uh, 367 bio biologically. Oh my goodness. No. Blah. Excuse me there. But anyways, yeah, let's get on with... Um, with the characters, we got Secret here, who is a sheltered child and a herbalist. 
and his traits are psychically dull and op uh, optimist, which is um d actually really good. I really I really got lucky with his traits. Um, and he's an incapable nun, so he's a he's a pretty good guy. And watch him die, like straight away, straight straight away. Oh my goodness. And then we got Amelia, who's 22. She's a pyromani pyromaniac and a ranch owner. Um, and grew and grew to become a ranch owner. Uh, her trait is beautiful and jealous, which <laughs> I think that's kind of a uh, kind of funny. But she's uh, incapable of dumb labor and firefighting, so I I don't believe she can haul. Um. I'm not quite sure. I, I think that I would actually would say if she couldn't haul. But um and then and then finally we have da Dashi who was pampered and then became a ninja assassin. <laughs> um one thing that I kinda wanna do, can we get a male Labrador uh no missing by seventeen. How about this? How about we don't take one thing of medicine? Or how about two? Just kind of self-penalizing myself. All right. So we're gonna start out with two less medicine for a male Labrador. We also would have to, you know, make a lot more food and stuff for those two. But, anyways, let's get started. And I accidentally um clicked through the uh little title thing that said uh you know your your ship was crashing. You know, basic information. Whoops. All right. There we go. Uh, meals. Hold on, let's go ahead and get. If there's, oh, there's not. All right. Um. Also, any. Any steel that's around the area. All right. Now let's actually take a look at our characters real quick, because I didn't. I didn't realize that. Uh, who's gonna be melee? Um. Oh wow. Secret. You're gonna be melee. I don't really want you to be melee. I would rather you have a gun. But. Um. To uh. I'm just, I'm just gonna, like, hopefully have you hiding in a corner most of the time. But anyways, let's take a l uh, look at this map that we have. Um, I've hardly actually play um, on, you know, flat terrain maps. So this is kind of out of my element, I must say. Um, there's actually a lot of these random abandoning uh, structures about... Uh... Where should we actually start? Uh, where should we set up? Ooh, there's some rich soil over there. Uh, more over here. Is there any geysers around that area? No. Oh, but there's a lot of uh, soil up here that is f fertile. But, n nah, there's one right there. I guess we can start our base around this central area. And have this to be our little temporary home. Or this could be our temporary home for now. And then kind of move over here once we start building. Alright, so. Basic basic setup. Let's go ahead and have our stockpile. Um, let's have it a 6x8. Uh, let's go ahead and just cut the trees around there. Um, whoops. Dumping stockpile. Uh, just put you right here for now. Uh, clear all and only chunks. All right. Um, uh, work. Let's go to the priorities. Set all you to one doctor. Ooh, we haven't. I didn't even realize that she was a twelve doctor. Um. If we need you, uh, put bed rest at one, look at one, warden, let's have, yeah, you're going to be our warden, and you're also going to be our handler, alright, um, let's take everyone off of hunting for right now, um, secret, you're going to be our cook, So yeah, we're just gonna put you on three for that. Uh, 
Yeah, if there's something that needs to be mined, go ahead and mine it. Um, I may take uh, Dashi off of construction later on. Oh, wow. Okay, hold on. Let's go ahead and... Eight, seven, all right, let's go ahead and put you on research then. Uh, cleaning, that could be at a four. Hall. Uh. All right, that seems all right. We also need you. Oh wow! I didn't realize that two people didn't have a uh, plant cutting. All right. Anyways, let's. Uh, I guess you can be on art. Put you on everything. Yeah, sure. Um, Amelia, do you have the pistol? Yes, you do. Let's go ahead and put you on hunting. Detail. If there is something that's out there that I want hunted, I pretty much want you to hunt it pretty fast. Um, who else? Okay, yeah, Dashi's also a hunter too, so let's put, also put you on two for now. Oh, almost forgot the sil silver. Alright. Now let's go ahead and box box this in. Also, uh, restrictions. Let's put you on work detail all the day, all throughout the day, up until two hours before bed. Speaking of, let's go ahead and put a uh, a wooden um, horseshoe up. Yeah, everyone needs us to haul everything close. Oh, that's actually going to be kind of... I didn't realize that only one person could actually plant cut. But, um... Yeah, because that's going to actually make our uh, process of cutting down trees a lot more difficult. Alright, so let's go ahead and um, get some zones put down. Um... Is this gra uh, gravel? Yeah. Okay. So we're going to kind of have to do this a little bit methodically. Um, ch ch Let's see. 5 by 8. 5 by 10. I guess we can do that, yeah. Another 5 by 10. Alright. Kind of have this. That might be some uh, here hill root. Seven by twelve. Six by eight. All right. So I want you to grow corn. I want you to grow. I don't, I don't really know what you. I want you to grow right now. So let's go ahead and just. Strawberry, heel root. Um, I might actually, um, I might actually grow some hops right here, but for now, let there be just potatoes. All right. Also, orders, chop wood. 
chop like a lot of the wood in the area. Let's get these uh, plants planted down and growing so we have a good uh, food supply. Alright, now I'm I'm wanting to build um, the base around uh, this, uh, uh, around, around these two. Yeah, I could actually start the base around here. That's actually quite of a trip though. Um, See, I don't really know where I should start the base. Definitely feel like it should be um, around here, though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and just let them plant um, all this before I start planning on a um, actual beginning of a base. Let's go ahead and start planning our um, base. Ooh, there's a little bit of a uh, steel there. Alright, let's go ahead and go with structure. Let's actually pause it for a second. Um, since I'm wanting to build it around here, um, around these two uh, air, uh, steam vents, um, I don't know where I should actually have my freezer. I guess I'm going to just put it right here for now. And have like this area to be my starting uh, power area. I have this one down here that should be my second area at some point. Alright, yeah, that actually sounds like a pretty good idea. Um, let's go with wooden wall. Let's see, Han, let's go ahead and make this roof. But yeah, this is just going to be our starting uh, power room or whatnot. Let's uh, go ahead and get started on the rest of uh, this this freezer. Wooden door. There we go. Made an airlock. Uh, ch 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 orders. All things. All those. Chop wood. Chop all of those. Let's actually cancel some of these. Um, let's go ahead and put a uh, fuel stove down, and then a wooden butcher's table, and then let's put the area down, or the stockpile down. Uh, storage, clear all, foods... Uh, manufactured medicine, raw resources, hops, and have that to be preferred. Yes. All right. Come on, wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. They're getting all that built, nice and speedy, which makes me happy. Uh, floors. Why not go with the wooden floors? Alright, so I think I should be thinking about bedrooms right about now. Um, let's see, if I do this... Wooden... And wood. Light. And then a floor. Alright, let's go ahead and fast forward.
I should also make a uh, stock room too. Stockpile room. So let's go ahead and get to wooden wall. How big should I make this? Uh, um, let's call this, uh, fort, um, uh, fort, fort forest, okay, yeah, <laughs> sure, why not, great name, uh, let's actually dis disconstruct this. Let's go ahead and cancel that. We'll put a wooden door if we need one in the meantime. Um, bad animal, a hare. Ow. Uh. Come here and deal with this problem. All right. Yeah, y'all should be on your on y'all's way. Except you, you need to stab that son of a bitch. <laughs> Where did you get bit on the torso and the leg? See that thing jumped up at you and bit you. <laughs> that would actually would be kind of terrifying to have a to have like a rabbit just like fucking launch itself at you and bite you on the chest. And then I'm going to copy settings, delete orders, no zone. Paste. Also, orders, haul things. Haul, of, haul all of you. Alright, I'm going to end this part right here. Um,. Because the episode actually kind of been has been uh, going on for a little bit longer. Um. Oh, all all, all of them uh, stargazing. Oh no, playing horseshoes. Oh, they're all playing horseshoes. I thought they was all stargazing. <laughs> but yeah. Anyways, um, I'm gonna end this episode here. If you liked the episode, please give it a like. And if you want to have live updates, please follow me on my Twitter down below. Um, if you want to get any of these mods, um, just look or the game itself, um, look down in the description below, links will, you know, you should find the links that you need to have fun. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. What fun is there in making sense?